late morning. We've been up for quite a while. I had a terrible, terrible night's sleep last night. I have no idea why. I woke up about two o'clock and then I don't think I went back to sleep till about six. So I'm quite tired this morning. Although I did sleep from six till maybe half eight, nine. So I've got quite a few hours, but I'm just feeling quite tired. Yesterday I promised you a little villa tour before my mum and my sister got here because I figured it would be even messier than it is now. <laughs> I did try and tidy up a little bit this morning, but you know what, I'll just show it you as it is. I'm gonna go out the back and show you. So this bit is like the complex where all the houses come open onto. This is, it's like the front, we call it the back because it makes more sense, but it has got the front door on it. And this is like the swimming pool is up there. Yeah. So here it is. Stephen's just sitting, Did relaxing. You call this the back? Yeah, I call this the back. Do you call it the front? Yeah. Oh, I call it the back. Just been sitting doing some editing there. Oh, I broke the chair last night, by the way. I did say it did collapse on me. Out here is just like the outhouse bit where we store, as you can see, like Stephen's toys and things. And there's the washing machine in there. And then through into the house. Over here is bathroom and me. Hi. Uh, got a shower and toilet and then straight across the hall this is the kitchen and through here it's just like one big downstairs area with obviously I mean we don't really use the dining table in the summer obviously we're outside and then lounge area again we don't really sit inside in the uh, in the summer but then out the doors is the downstairs balcony which is nice then we'll go up the stairs spiral stairs do, do, do. and up here there are three bedrooms bathroom first off over here toilet sink bath shower and this is the room so there's this room here this room me again hi and that room, this is the room that we have been sleeping in. This is like the main bedroom, double bed. And with the upstairs balcony, there's like ceiling fans everywhere, obviously to keep you a bit cool. This is the upstairs balcony. I think you've probably seen like the views from here before. I've sat out here a few times. The mountains over there. And the sea over there. And then back through. This is the smallest bedroom, which doesn't particularly get used, to be honest. It's, my sister sometimes sleeps in here, but she says it's quite hot, I don't know. D, and then this is the room that me and Stephen sleep in, excuse the mess and clothes and stuff everywhere. This is where we sleep and this is where we'll be moving over to tomorrow. No, not tomorrow, my mum's arriving today, so we'll be back sleeping in this bedroom today. And then from the window, you can see the complex, I'll probably show you around the complex another day, a little bit more, but that's like the gardens and stuff. So yeah, there is the villa tour. Did you? Okay? Yeah, I get my <laughs> 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 Do you want that bit of glass? <laughs> oh! Really? <laughs> 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 Oh, oh. 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 Oh.
Huh? <laughs> Am I really? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Yeah. Make it so everyone can hear your scream. I'm going to fall <laughs> it's lunch time, so I'm just coming in to get Stephen some lunch. Oh, hello. You okay? Oh, it's dark in here. Make Stephen some lunch. Are you going to get your book? Oh, yeah. Yeah? I've had a bit of a crazy morning in the pool and playing on the grass and so we're just going to have a little chill out time for a little bit. They're all going to sit in line and read their books. Hopefully that's the plan. I'm going to get some lunch for Stephen. Pretty much the same thing he's been having every single day. And I'm having some nectarines. and I'm off to collect my mum and sister from the airport. Stephen was going to come with me because we think that the airport will be a poker stop. But he has changed his mind. Now he's, now it's come to it. He's far too busy playing, so he's going to stay with all the kids and obviously like the mums and dads. <laughs> not a poker stop, but that weird-ass sculpture that we saw on the way in is a poker stop. So I think I've got a little few minutes to see if I can collect it. I'm too far away. Oh, I'm too far away because it's like there. Look at that weird thing. Weird sculpture? Definitely. No, I can't get close enough because it's in the middle of a roundabout. Never mind. This is airport. This is Castellon Airport. We've never been here before. It's about 20 minutes drive away from the villa and it was built years and years ago and Spain built about 20 odd airports I think around the country and then they just sat not being used for years and years and finally this one has opened they only do flights from London Stansted and Bristol I think so they don't do them for the north of England which is where we're from but obviously because my sister lives in London my mum has gone down there and they've got a flight it's a much better journey because normally it's like a I have to go and pick them up from Valencia which is I don't know an hour and a half away or something Let's go and see if they've arrived. They should have done. I've got them. We're on our way out for tea. Been a bit of a mad little rush. We were kind of, we booked a table for eight. And all of a sudden it was five past eight. Wanted to have a shower, wash my hair, that couldn't happen. I've literally come out in. I was going all day, never mind. Going to JJ's. My mum, my sister, Stephen, me, and Lisa, our friend, with her kids. Hopefully, it'll be nice. I've got here, she could have some bread. I want some parmesan. I've got an onion on top. Ooh. Do you? That is my chicken. 